Well, hello everybody, and today I'm going to be reviewing the, what is it called again, 2023 Chevron Corboretta Manita, 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 whatever that says. It is the 3LTZ51 uh, Black Ops, uh, color is Arctic White. And it, it it has the base uh with black rims. Um, I've seen this car everywhere. Everywhere. And so I wanna test it out myself and I wanna see is it really worth seventy one thousand dollars? Um I mean we're about to find out. I have not really dri I literally came straight from the dealership to here um to review this. So I'm not really sure, I'm not really sure, uh, all the specs of it and stuff. So we can learn together, I guess. Uh, yes, this was $71,800. Like um, so pretty expensive. Uh, I'm, I'm reviewing the lower model cars because that's what most people are going to get. I don't think a lot of people, at least that I've seen, have the $146,000 one. So I'll just be reviewing this one. Um, it is the Black Op trim. Uh, from what I know, it has like two seats. Two seats. Um, don't know how fast it goes. Uh, but yeah, let's let's go ahead and test it out. So I guess the first thing we should uh, look at is the startup. So let's look at the startup or listen to it. Listen to that idle. Okay, that's not actually bad. I didn't listen to it the first time I started this car. And let's rev it a little. Not a bad rev. Does not spit any fire or anything. Um, let's look at blinkers. Let's look at blinkers. Uh, this would be our right blinker. Ooh, that's really cool. I didn't know that it did that for the back tail lights. Uh, here's the other one. Oh, lag. Unneeded. I don't know why it's lagging. And then this is our hazards. That's really cool. Brake lights. I don't know what that noise was. Whoops. Uh, yeah, hazards. Uh, let's turn off. Let's, I said turn, turn off. Brake lights. I don't know why it kept on doing the blinkers. Horn. nice horn and uh yeah i mean this thing uh overall looks i give it a good like 8.5 out of 10 i'm not a huge like fan of these type of cars but uh this one actually i think i actually really like this if i'm if i'm gonna be honest so the next thing i want to do is see the zero to 60 test so let me pull up a stopwatch here on my phone real quick and we will do the stopwatch okay in five four hold on i want to see if it rolls forward like some of the other cars no it does not okay in five four three two one That was quick. That was uh, two seconds, I think. Let's redo that. Hold on. Give me a second. Actually, let's put it in gear. That way I can actually use all my hands. Ready, set, go. Yeah, literally two seconds. That's crazy. And I guess, why is it lagging so bad? Holy moly. It never lags like this. Okay, and now let's do 
let's see how fast this thing goes. I'm kind of interested to see that. But hey, this thing gets up to speed really, really, really fast. So I'm kind of interested to see how fast this thing will go. We just hit just 195, I think is going to be the highest. We're going to get this thing. Is not good at, like, keeping control, but hey, that's, that's okay. Um, I do not recommend off-roading with this thing. That would not, that not be good. Uh, it's cool. Oh, I forgot there's a water tower there. Ooh. So, yeah, I think this thing is a two-seater. It is a two-seater. Um, two-seater. I mean, it has headlights. Uh, if y'all didn't know, it has headlights. Um, this thing, this thing is actually really, really nice. Uh, but, like, is it worth it for purchasing? My next test, I want to do a test with this thing. My next test will determine if it, if it's worth it. Mind me, just going 160 miles an hour in the 55. Perfectly legal. Oh god. Oh no. Okay, that happened. So this test basically is... We're basically going to yeet this car into the ditch over here that the devs recently added. And we're going to see if we can make it up to the road that's right here, okay? So in 5, 4... Three, two, one, let's go. Let's see if we can do it. I don't think we can. Oh, God. This is a bad idea. What? No way. The thing just made it up that. No way. Hold up. Oh. No, stop. No. Oh. Hold on. Give me a second. Okay. Let's not get stuck this time. Yeah. Okay. Maybe let's put it let's put it in this drive and not as close, okay? Hold on. I wanna see like Hold on. Oh, I knew that was gonna be a bad idea. And of course the lag starts hitting in. Come on. Go got in reverse. Let's see. No. I wonder how much of a boost do we actually need to get up this thing? We don't want to put it in park. That almost did it, I feel like. Why do I keep on putting the thing in park? Let's let's get up. Let's get up out of here. Now full throttle. Oh! Oh! So close! I keep on putting this thing in park. I need to stop doing that. make it up it should make it up what man my truck would not disappoint me doing this my truck easily get up here but then again this is like a sports car and i'm pretty sure if this was real life this thing would not have a bumper no more actually it probably have no wheels or headlights for that matter of fact no way it can't get up can it not get up okay Okay. For how sporty this thing is, you'd think it'd be able to get up this without a problem. Oh, close. Close. We would just have to go a little bit farther back. Uh, basically back to where we started with our first test. Ah. Okay, that's sad. I'm, I'm done playing around with in the ditch. This is embarrassing for this car. It's not good for, it is really not good for off-roading. I consider not off-roading with this car. And to be honest, if you are off-roading in this car, good luck, uh, cause you're not gonna get very far. Okay, well the car just decided to stop right there, would not go. Um, 
So that's embarrassing for the car. You know what? I might actually keep this. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. I have an idea. It's an idea that should have not, it should have not been thought of, but guess what? Here we are thinking of stuff that should not be thought of. Hold up. So if I were to, I see, I see, I see. They move it over. I see. I'm not sure where it is. Where is it? Oh, it's over there. Oh my god. <laughs> Man, that thing flew. And we. Oh god. Lord of mercy. And up we go. Oh goodness. We. Oh no. Almost got this thing stuck for for a second. You know what? I have a better idea. Hold on. Give me one second. I promise you, y'all. This is a good idea. Maybe. I'm not really sure. Oh. Uh, I can barely see where we're going. Oh, the bridge is over there. Oh, God. Oh, God. Lord have mercy. Whoa, that was... That was crazy. That was crazy. Let's see how good the drifting is. Okay. Alright, either I don't know how to drift or this thing sucks at drifting. Alrighty, y'all. We have beat this thing to the bone. We have gotten it a little dirty. Uh, went off-roading with it. Tested how fast it goes. Some of its abilities, blinkers, horns, how many seats it has. Um, I'll put more details of this of this car in the description of this video. Now, is it worth seventy one thousand dollars? And I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I I think so. I mean, I I'm gonna keep it. I think it I think it it was a lot of fun driving it. It is a lot of fun driving it. It, it goes like 194 miles an hour. Uh, this this car is actually, in my opinion, should be a little bit more expensive, if anything. Um, but yeah, so so I guess that didn't really answer any of y'all's questions. Is it worth it? I think it is. I I, I would definitely buy this. Um. Now, would I, would I have it as a daily driver? No, mainly because everyone else has one. Like, every single person. Like, like everyone. Like, tons and 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 tons of people have this. So, uh, yeah. I think, I think, I think it is worth it for the fourth time that I've said that alrighty y'all i think that's gonna do it for this video um if y'all did like the video please consider uh liking and subscribing and comment in or bleh comment what you want me to do next and i am always looking at y'all's uh i forgot how to speak i'm always looking at y'all suggestions in the comments so uh please comment games that you want me to play, and I will gladly play them. Um, and turn on the notification bell for uh, that way you never miss a post. My goodness, why is it? Why am I stuttering so much? I'm so sorry. Um, please consider subscribing. I already said that. Uh, yes, turn on the notification bell and let me know what you want me to do in the comments. And yeah, that, that's going to be all. Y'all have a great day and bye-bye.